Hey everyone, welcome back to Average Flow. Jesus, we haven't seen each other for a really long time. Anyway, it has been a really warm summer here in London and I kept myself busy. I mean, in between all those blurry alcoholic nights out in clubs and strip joints, I'm just messing with you. I never buy alcohol in strip joints, it's too fucking expensive but I somehow managed to visit some really amazing places. Today, I'm really excited to show you one of the best parks I've ever been to, Primrose Hill, which I often called it Primrose during the video. Primrose, 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 not Prime, Prim. Now, I live an hour away by bicycle from Primrose Hill and I thought that the road to get there, it will be very boring uh, with the traffic and all. But I found another way to travel there and uh, that was along the canals and that was really awesome because the amount of interesting things happening on London's canal during the weekend is absolutely overwhelming. Just like the amount of fucking people that you need to avoid unless you want to take an early shower with your bike in the canals. Not pleasant. Not pleasant at all. Even so, from funky restaurants to small beautiful gardens, you'll need to embrace the vibe of these lively canals. If you're lucky and you pass by the floating library with the live music, take a moment and enjoy that feeling, because it's real. <laughs> can be terribly bored by it and you can take your Boris bike and keep strolling to that bloody park that I'm about to tell you about. Now Primrose Hill is located in the middle of London, really close to Regent's Park, which we're gonna talk about in a future video. And if you're not interested in cycling to there, you can always take the tube for uh, the quickest solution, for the quickest option, or you can use the bus for an experience you will never forget although you would be willing to give your right arm 
just to wipe it from your memory. Now the hill summit reaches 65 meters and it gives a panoramic view over the central London which is breathtaking. Unlucky for me, when I got there it started raining. No surprise for me there, London. But there are many trees under which you can cover yourself from rain or under which you can have a quality picnic with your friends or with your family, which I had at a later date. You can easily spend a few relaxing hours in this park and I can guarantee you that the selfies taken will not disappoint you. So this was my experience in Primrose Hill. I really hope that you can top that. Really soon I'm gonna leave for Portugal, Albufeira. I've never been there, I've heard only good stuff. I'm gonna take my camera and I'm gonna show you what you're missing on. Thanks for watching this video. If you enjoyed it, don't forget to hit the like button and for more videos like this, just go with the flow and subscribe to Average Flow. See you guys.